Hello guys, welcome to Mini Orange. Do you know about the API Key Authentication Method? In this video we are going to show you what is API Key Authentication Method for WordPress REST APIs and how we can set up it using the Postman tool. So let's get started. API Key Authentication Method involves the WordPress REST API's access on validation against the API key provided by the plugin rather than user login credentials, the API key is validated for each API request and then API is allowed to be accessed accordingly. Let's take an example. If you want to protect your WordPress REST API endpoints from unauthenticated users but you don't want to share users' login credentials or client ID, secret to authenticate the REST API, how we can achieve this? Here is the user flow for how API key authentication with bearer token works with the Mini Orange plugin. As in the first point, the mobile application will send an API request with the token obtained from the plugin passed in the header. WordPress REST API Authentication plugin will authenticate the token. If the response obtained from the last step is successful, the API resources are allowed to be accessed. The API Key Authentication method supports the MiniOrange REST API Authentication paid plugin version, so once you buy the plugin you can install the plugin using this method. So let's install the plugin. Go to the WordPress dashboard and click on Plugins tab. Click on Add New. Click on the Upload Plugin button. Click on Choose File. Now, select the MiniOrange REST API Paid Plugin Zip and upload it. Click on Install Now button to install the plugin. Now activate your plugin by clicking on Activate Plugin button. Now you can see the WordPress REST API Authentication plugin is activated successfully. Go to the plugin and log in with MiniOrange credentials. Once you have logged in, you can see the supported authentication methods. Select API key method and click on the Save Configuration button. Once you save the configuration, under the Universal API key section you will get the option to generate new token. You can use it to secure your WordPress REST API's endpoints, you need to pass it to the header while making the REST API request. Now go to our API Key Authentication documentation, you can find the documentation link in the description box, and here, you will find the JSON file which we will need to import it into Postman tool, download the JSON file. So let's go to the Postman tool. Now, click on the Import option. Click on the Upload File button to upload the file. Select the JSON file which you have downloaded earlier. Click on Import button. Your file is imported successfully. Now, click on the REST API request under the Collections tab. Here, you can see the GET method and the request URL, replace the base URL with your WordPress domain. Go to the Headers section, and replace the bearer token with the token value as generated in the plugin. Click on the Send button to send the request. After sent the request, in the body section, you can see we received successfully response here. Now, if you want to import code in your own language, just click on the code link, and here you can see the different languages, just copy it and import. Thank you for watching this video, for any other questions drop us a query on info at securify.com.